There's a story here, and so we'll take that quickly. When I met my fiancé about one and a half years ago, he was reserved, kind, and humble. However, although I'm also a little bit reserved, uh, we managed to be the best of friends. I'm 28, and he is 37. Now, when we decided to get married, he kept emphasizing on the fact that he would sign in court and not do any wedding. But I told him that my church does not approve of that unless a wedding comes off. Later, he adjusted his thoughts and opted for a small wedding. But I've told him my family too will not approve of that because I'm the only daughter of my mother. Now, he keeps insisting, but I explained to him that my family will not allow a wedding with only 100 invited guests. I want 400 invited guests, but he wants only close family members and friends. We're at loggerheads now, and time is not on our side because our wedding should happen middle of March. I've told him I have a large family, so he should understand, but he seems unmoved by my plea. I'm confused now. Please, what should I do? Because I know he can afford a big wedding. Councillor George Lutrot is here, as well as his art nemesis. <laughs> See, as, lo as well as my boy. As Kelly. well as your boy. Yes. Are you hey. kidding me? Oh, boy? I see. I that's, miss you guys, though. Yeah, How are you doing? Miss you too. You're, forgiven. You're forgiven. I mean, luckily enough, last week you, you were not here. All uh -huh. He was also not here. I, I oh, he deliberately, wasn't. because I could, I mean, you're the one and who told I was me to very come excited down when, when, when he has to. I was so because, glad I didn't come. If yeah, I had come, because, fireworks here. Because yeah. when he sees you, he commits a lot of fornication. So oh, Lord. I wanted him to be here, but um, he didn't come. You know, you, he's the re you are the reason why. No, receive, receive no, you are the reason. You are the reason why he comes. But think well, well because I'm glad. he cannot offer the type of wedding you're expecting. Uh, so don't wait, bring I, such I, a I, thing I, home. I'm expecting. Don't bring such a thing home. What do you want? What, what, what are you? No, you have waited word. too long to get us just anything. Home. You and who? Oh, my sister. <laughs> One member, <Papa. laughs> We have set the pace for you, Bella. So funny enough, I was because you, you've not joined the Bowen group. So then, do something sensible. What do you mean? The B one, B two. You are not there. Oh, you are planning to do that? Like I'll <laughs> curse you. What on now? Well, this is not about me. This is about. Hey, hey it's about you. Don't need, don't need your email. There's, there's a lady what are you who has a about? problem. Her family wants a big wedding. Right. She also clearly <clears throat> wants a big wedding, but her man first says. Let's sign. Now he says, okay, if you want a wedding, let's go ahead. But I only want 100 invited guests. I thought that was even too much. Because Bella, for someone who wants to sign, I thought he would ask for maybe 50 guests and that would be it. The question we should ask is, big wedding for what? To achieve what? So that what would happen? It's a celebration. Yes, celebration, yes. But why a big wedding because. why a celebrity wedding why a why a uh what what other word can we use why blow money even if you have it because i have it i have more yes but what do you want to achieve <sighs> What wait? What what is a wedding meant to achieve? First, a all? wedding is meant that. to celebrate the joining of two people, okay. a man and a woman, mm -hmm. in holy matrimony, and so they are throwing a party to that mm -hmm. effect. There's mm -hmm. no holy matrimony. In matrimony, don't say in, holy matrimony. in matrimony. Well, holy matrimony. well, uh, there's nothing holy. They are, they are getting matrimony. It's matrimony. Uh, hello, Counselor, let him speak. They are getting you. married. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They want to celebrate. Mm -hmm. If you have the money, you genuinely have the money. Mm -hmm. Blow it how you want to blow it mm -hmm. as as long as you have cost in mind mm -hmm. where cost means mm -hmm. being prudent okay. no matter how wealthy you are mm -hmm. you don't blow money because money is available oh. you you spend money because you are prudent enough to know that an account has been hold apportioned on. to that hold on so no, let me no, give this no. scenario okay yeah sure so a couple is married for maybe 20 30 years they yes. struggle before they have a child yes god blesses them with a daughter or yes. a son yes now this child grows up they are so happy they, they spend on this child because this is a blessing to them and their child finally is going to get married and they have all the money in the world are you telling them that even though they have all the money that's not what i'm telling them i am telling them this is their as only child Pro ah, what you what, know, is, what is, is prudence? You the president attended the wedding prudence? ceremony of the daughter of Dangote. Mm -hmm. Listen, the girl says, Bill Gates no was man. available. Yeah, uh, even Bill, Bill Gates was there. Was there. No I man, know. No man can remember. Perfect prudence, mentality. Hold on. Futa, futa, futa. Hello, hello. <laughs> prudence is not about whether Bill Gates came for your wedding or not. Oh! Bill Gates can come for your 
come to your wedding uh -huh. for a reason. For what reason? For what reason? There are many reasons Give why you should two. bring Bill Gates to your wedding. There is a reason why Bill Gates would come uh, to your uh, wedding. No, to no. your wedding, ex ex because exactly. you play in the same league. It's certainly. Yes. Uh -huh. Hold on, hold you're on, hold on. Must play Listen. by sizes. No, exactly, exactly. I don't that have an issue with a flamboyant wedding. Do it you know that on, Prudence, on, hello, Tara, let him land Prudence, on this one. why do you never allow me land on okay, this Okay, Kelly, show? go ahead. You have Prudence, a problem. <laughs> you have a map no, control Kelly, problem. You can't Focus. Land. Prudence, Prudence is relative. What prudence is to you mm -hmm. might not be what prudence is to this. What happened? We have general prudence. Prudence, prudence, prudence is, is living within means most preferable. Ah, by who? Where preferable? <laughs> oh. Listen, okay, listen. Okay, Kelly, land on this. So I don't, I don't have a problem with land, people land, land, spending land, 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 whatever. Yeah. Land, land, land. I, I just believe that no matter how wealthy I am, mm -hmm. there's an account apportioned for every expenditure. Mm -hmm. And as long as you don't cross the budget of your oh, expenditure, you are prudent. Okay. So if you spend a billion dollars on a wedding when that you, you have planned, billion? exactly, do that. Oh that billion God. is just a drop in the ocean. Exactly. Oh no, no. So pr what is prud prud what prudence okay. is to Bill Gates is not what prudence is to a Dangote. But, yeah, but a Dangote and Bill Gates, they are in the same league. Uh, they might not exactly be. They, they are not is exactly the, not the richest African in the world. In, in, the, in Africa. In the world. And Bill Gates is the richest man where? In the world, yes. Exactly. They are, they are still not colleagues, but they fly in, the, in a certain category. What I'm saying but the is cost this. Of a wedding in Africa will be less. Ooh. What I'm saying is this. Spend Ooh. whatever you want to spend. Okay. But plan for it. Okay. Planning brings the prudence. Okay. Let as long as in. planning is involved, you are fine. Spend anything. <laughs> okay. But don't spend to impress, even if you have. Because you're, you're getting nothing. Oh. Even if you're, you can afford it, why spend money to impress somebody? If, if you're wealthy, you're wealthy. Nobody needs to know you're wealthy. As a matter of fact, do you know that when really wealthy hey, people so have... You <laughs> hold on. Do you, know that, hold do you know that? Do you hold know on. that? Do you know that when really more. wealthy people have birthdays and all of that, the cake is so small, so tiny, in just a oh. saucer? So I'm not, and I'm not saying that the bigger cakes matter less or more. I'm just saying that moderacy, regardless of your position, must be considered. No That's problem. all. I'm going to make public. Make public. Yes. Come in. Thank you. you I'm coming. Tell me what, what you think about Good what morning, Kelly ladies and gentlemen. And this is the time we started the show. What you were hearing was not on air. We just came back on air. Which way? Listen carefully. <laughs> the story you narrated. Uh -huh. I'll keep praying for you. There's so many. Don't stop praying because I pay for the prayer. Listen carefully. Pay right. who? <laughs> Bono Tashi, me pay. Listen carefully. Me. Oh, don't even tell him. Don't caution him. He'll keep quiet at the right time. But wait. <laughs> Listen carefully. Watch here. The story you narrated to us, uh -huh. there are errors we have to correct. And that is where the problem is. And these people, this category of people in our country, who are leading that trouble in the letter you read, must hear this. Mm -hmm. In the first place, in Ghana, there is nothing called Christian marriage. So my church say, the pastors are the burdens for these mediocre weddings that girls go and cry after. Or magnificent wedding that they regret because of their preaching. Uh -huh. In life, they say, if money is the root of all evil, oh my God, Poverty should never be an option for you. If you meet a man and he has all the money, okay. shop the money because in life, there are three, there are only three segments to our life. We have the body, the soul, and the spirit. Mm -hmm. So when you are born, there's a naming ceremony. When you're getting married, that's where you, it's another event. Mm -hmm. And the last event that we all respect is death. Which when I go, I'll come back to TV3 every morning show when the person is sitting down my no, chair. <laughs> oh my God, my third. I feel it comes like you're on a job. What I mean is that it's a three event. Now, the third most important event, you don't choose what to wear. Which death? Even when you buy a tomb, the family has the right to change it. Mm -hmm. So it means that you don't make decisions. When you are born, the name for you is waiting. You don't make decision. Mm -hmm. My dear, the only time decision making is relevant and important in your life is when you make a decision to be marrying in particular colors, particular dress. Mm -hmm. Bella, the laws of the country doesn't cover the numerical strength of the eaters at your wedding. Mm -hmm. The laws of the land that doesn't have church marriage 
Remember, Ghana, we don't have church marriage. Okay. We have civil union. And the civil union that you want to sign, the rules govern it is that you should not be married to any other person. Mm -hmm. But when you want to nullify your traditional marriage, you can come. So the weddings you see, the structures we form, they are dreams that we want to see. People are watching. Is it? Is it? Bishop Ajansari. People. people. I think Hold it's on. Bishop. People. Bishop Ajansari. People are yeah. watching. Who Hold came on, back to celebrate a wedding ceremony because then, and between her speech and the wife, when we we're having the wedding, some of the things that were supposed to be there, it was not there because Afe Noko Naka represented Noko. Mm -hmm. So they came back to do something now that will be fitting to see the pictures in the sitting room. So there are people today who see their picture in the sitting room of their own city hall and they look at, hey, what is this? this that alone is drying the marriage you understand mm -hmm. you talk about how was your wedding and they can't talk because when they cast their mind back there is nothing but it was a core blega it was mokwatale nama it was not because they can't afford it but the church is the problem they make you believe that the marriage is a church wedding so follow the rules in the church mm -hmm. there's a church is it pentecost church they, they took reception out of the thing the i thing have what it takes yes of wedding yes so right now, if you do weddings in their place, you do not, they don't even have premises for you to have reception. You can go and have it elsewhere, but not there. Oh, but other churches, I mean, you can still go and have your reception elsewhere. No, but their own is a standard. Other churches, because you don't have the venue. Okay. You understand? Other okay. churches, because you don't have this. the venue. I'm now finding but their own, that was what the law was. So you, okay. don't, you don't really want to. They say it's a bedding, it's this, it's that. Oh. What is bedding if I decide? And look, there are times that you don't know why people are having family weddings. Mm -hmm. Bella, as you are sitting, if you mind just anything, you will laugh at you. You and who? Hey! And what do you mean anything? Oh, but you, I mean, uh, when? But, but marriage is between two people, like Kelly said. No, no, Why that's what you see. You see, you see when one of the things people. you know is that marriage is not about two people. Keep that when, one when out of your people. range. Mine is about who? Exactly. No, okay, so like, yes, exactly. The two of you must When you now. begin to consider na, people, na, people, na, people. Now, listen, listen, listen. Well, how this people will feel, <laughs> how that person will feel, what Bella, this person has to say about my wedding. What do we want? Bella, are you married? Bella, are you married? I'm not saying not. I don't have a Okay, so how do we know? What, not mine. what do the we public, want? We are where you are not mine. What Bella, is... where you marry? Will we know? Well, I, you I don't may not you need are, to you know. know. Let me tell you something. Bella, you owe us. No, no listen. She, Bella, that she you owe nobody. us. There That's are people the point in I'm this trying to make. Uh -huh. You don't uh -huh. need, uh -huh. and nobody even and knows they are still married. Only a few people okay, know that so they are married. Okay, so it's not between the two of them. Yes, they are. No, they are up there. Still, it's not between the two of them. It's not just about two. Hello, you are changing your mind. Hold on, hold on, hold on. my mind. Okay, I change your mouth. It's quite chaotic here. Let's have one person speak at a time. So I'm the one speaking. Let the land. Let the land. Keep your beard. Land. And your dry hair because we are no Bemu. Listen, oh, God. your hair is not dry. How's that? Thank you It was Kelly. Now let's go ahead. Watch your hair. You see, Kelly, let. Mine is not between two people. It's That's the thing to stop. Two families. It's between two families. And as large as the family is, that is how large your marriage is. But it should so be about your pockets too. No, you see, watch it. As large as the family is. So if you want the tree for marriage, if I make a decision to marry you, the first thing is that it's the family that is making the decision to come and marry you. The man's family is deciding to When marry. I decide today to marry Bella, it is not me. It's the family's decision to marry Bella. Okay. That is why everything we do is family. Okay. I'm in love with someone. You're telling and me you that. Are, you are a point of correction. No woman can be in love, but a man is in love with you. Okay. So what I'm saying is that I'm in love with you. I want to come and marry you. It is the family that comes to marry you. I see. And when the family comes to marry you, remember, it is not two. That is why if I marry you today and there's a conflict between the two of us, my mother cannot call you to talk to you about the conflict. Because the marriage is between you and I. Because the marriage is between two <laughs> families. <laughs> Goodness. Hello. Okay, you hold no, on with this. this. Learn this. Conflict resolution in marriage. The reason why we are not having peace of mind is that when I offend you, you take me to your pastor. Mm -hmm. All right? Or you go and report me to my mother. Mm -hmm. You don't have that right. It is the two families that have right to bring the two of us together. So it is about families. So stop thinking that thing is about the two of us, it's about the two of us. That is why families come in to help. The original manuscript for even the weddings that we have going to copy under the ordinance, mm -hmm. which reception is not part of the legal things. The legal things involves you, the place who is gazetted to, to do it for mm -hmm. you, and those witnesses that are qualified and declaration of bonds. These are the things. And after it, are you aware that you may kiss the bride? It's an illegal thing. Are you aware? You may kiss yeah. the bride. It's an illegal thing. Because when I, when I exchange vows with you uh -huh. inside the church, and when we finish, that we are now going to sign. sign. I don't have right to kiss you. So the kissing should come after signing. When I, as a marriage officer, 
now declare you husband and wife the right to cases there so most of them officiating marriages they have not learned they are making mistakes okay so you see this married thing whether it's big or it's small as we keep saying monkeys play by what Sizes. sizes so the request of the girl is wrong why because it says that my church and her parents no my church yeah and then she said number her two when your parents are coming they are role plays for the parents the sponsoring of what goes on in wedding mm -hmm. is the woman's family Bella, okay. Bella, Hold on. Is... All right. So, uh, Councilor Lutras is saying that it's poverty mentality if you say you don't want to have a big wedding or people should not have a big wedding. Kelly Daniels, however, says that, um, you know, you can have what kind of wedding you want, especially if you're being careful about how much you spend, regardless of how rich you are. But I don't know about you, so I'm going on Facebook to find out what you think. And you can send us your messages as well. Would you prefer a big wedding or a small wedding? Michael Kwame says, small in terms of size or cost, or big in terms of numbers and cost. Because top celebs in Hollywood always do small weddings, but the cost alone is like feeding the whole of a crowd. You have a point. And I was going to ask them that we need to define what a big wedding and a small Thank wedding you. is. You now, Freedom Why Sebastian says, wedding mm -hmm. isn't about making it big or small, mm -hmm. whether you're rich or poor. Mm -hmm. The main idea here is to have a lovely home and to live well as husband and wife mm -hmm. and not spend so much on the wedding and afterwards not be at peace with each other mm -hmm. mami mm -hmm. abinasafwa says there's never an award for anyone in this world as a beautiful wedding or whatever oh it's coming so why my should i do a bigger one beyond my means and suffer Bella, after the ceremony okay. is what we really call we have marriage. To people. So marriage is george not james says a lot plan for their weddings but fail to plan for the marriage itself okay like going to school without having a plan yeah. after a few months at lectures you plan opting out because you know the C top. Which is normal. It means you go to the school and out. Apia Clement so, says, it's all about financial intelligence. Yeah, if your families can fine. support you and you're sure you'll not incur debt, when um, then you can go ahead. On the other hand, if you're not rich enough to spend your early millions on an occasion that will deteriorate your financial strength, then you must invest in something first and do a small marriage ceremony that may cost you nothing or very little. I know someone who bought a land and built a single room self-contained and invested in his wife's saloon business they had a simple marriage attended by 12 relatives and they went to sign at the assembly for their marriage certificate the lady is making more money now to support her husband and they plan on doing a bigger anniversary what you can see hold on you can see that they understand each other and they are sincere to themselves about their background and financial strength so first of all can we go ahead and define what a big wedding is yes uh, bella Yes, and, what and, must and I said, I can't say, you need to tell us what kind of wedding if no, you didn't no, have a poverty no, no, mentality hold on, hold on. wedding. Hey, Kelly, you do not see what, I am what talking. The video is there. Listen, this issue should not be about a big wedding uh -huh. or a small wedding. Uh -huh. We are not here to define what a big wedding is or what a small wedding is. We are here yeah, to talk about, to hello, hello. We are here to talk about what a proper wedding is. Oh, wait, there's a difference between a big wedding uh -huh. and a small wedding. Uh -huh. But there's regardless of what they are, uh -huh. what should be in perspective is what is a proper wedding. Okay. Okay. Now, let me tell you what a proper mm -hmm. wedding is. Okay. Mm -hmm. A proper wedding is a situation mm -hmm. where the most important people in your life you desire uh -huh. to attend uh -huh. are in attendance, mm -hmm. pleasuring them the way you plan to, uh -huh. okay. big or small. Uh -huh. Making them as comfortable as you can afford. Uh -huh. That's a proper wedding. Oh, whether no, no, big no, no, or small. No, no, no. I, I, I am talking. Okay. I am talking. I'm, I'm trying to understand. Because I'm please let him land. You can call can this proper I, wedding. Can I, let if, him if land, you are confused, please. can you Kelly. be humble enough to listen? Kelly. That's what I'm listening to. Kelly. So, listen Kelly. to humility. Okay. I'm too the, humble to be confused. A proper wedding mm -hmm. is a situation where the most important people in your life you desire to be there are present. Treating them the way you prefer the most they should be treated okay. in a way that you are happy and fulfilled. So it can be big that or small, but wedding. as long as your guests the, the are comfortable. The bigness or smallness is for the rest of the world to define. Okay. A proper wedding is a situation where the most important people in your life attend and then you take care of them the way that you best believe they should be treated. Okay. Period. Okay. That's one. Secondly, we need to understand that uh -huh. you do not do things for people, you do things for yourself. <laughs> now, what is yourself? Yourself is comprising of you and mm -hmm. everybody who is, is, is aligned with your value system. Yeah. Anyone who doesn't align your value system 
is, is, is outside your circle. And so if you do something to please those people, it, it, it's literally at And you can also disappoint people can who know how you are and I you give them wrong things. Talking. Mm. What you, you need can to understand, them. therefore, is this. Mm -hmm. You no, have no, no, no have right for you. to choose your father or your mother. Mm -hmm. But you have every right mm -hmm. to choose your father-in-law father or your mother-in-law. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So when I'm marrying you, mm -hmm. you and I need to ask ourselves what we see of the future ahead. Oh, uh -huh. my God. And I would relate, I would agree to marry you uh, uh, if your value systems and your family's value systems suit mine. Okay. Hello. So if that is sorted, there won't be an issue of um, your family wants a bigger wedding and I don't want no, a bigger but, wedding. But there will always as be differences. As, no, the, as long as those differences align with you and hello, I hello, first, hello, before hello, our hello. parents even get to know we are in love. Then let's go. But you can still be in love and never agree on sex. No, 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 no. The, the love is Hold different. Hold on, counselor. He's landing. The he love is land you, this guy. He's, he's landing. He's landing. The love is different. Unless I deflate But the you, understanding is, is, is different too. So, yes, we are in love. What do we want before our parents begin to come I in? want a big wedding. You want a small wedding. We have to compromise. We, we, yes, we would have to. So, the compromise, the choice of how the wedding turns out uh -huh. depends on the two people involved based on the backgrounds they have okay. before the issue even gets to their parents. Okay. So my parents are not going to decide what wedding I want, except my spouse and I <laughs> have talked about what we foresee could happen. Okay. So I want a small <laughs> wedding. You want a big wedding. <laughs> Your parents want a big wedding. Uh -huh. My parents want a small wedding. You and I will have to talk about it. Bella. What are the things that we need to put in place even before See. they get to know so okay. that you're happy and I'm happy? Okay, let's That's all I'm now. saying. You Please see, when define, they say, when they say what a big wedding or a small mother, wedding is, yeah. Uh, they determine. Now, pastors are even determining size of weddings. I didn't mention the pastor. Because you're afraid to tell them. But now, pastors are more powerful. Me, than afraid to tell them. How are pastors getting involved oh, in weddings? Some size. of them give you. No, no. They they are, can I finish? Are, like, tell this man I'm, I'm, I'm okay, giving him the Can you sleep as I talk? Listen carefully. You see? Now, pastors themselves are even determining the size of weddings and how it should run. What are you families? That's if they have a close relationship. It's not with. close relation. It has become a standard for the churches they run. I see. They have to put fear and panic in the people to follow them for the rest of their life. Even some can tell you that if you don't marry here, I won't bless your marriage. Even some will tell you that if the marriage is not in this format, I won't bless the marriage. Yeah, but so should, you so, have so, a right to marry there or where, not. Where should the wedding take place? In a church? No, in a the, uh, no, 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 no. no. Watch it here, the watch wedding it should oh, take place oh, 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 wrong? anywhere oh, oh, the blessing oh, oh, of God rests oh, oh, upon oh, oh, the couple oh, oh, involved. The question, Regardless of the location, there, there, there are weddings at the beach. No, but there are, such, there are certain locations where you can't get married. What is wrong with getting married at a beach? But there have been conversations about that. What is wrong with getting married So Lenny. That there are certain certified places that you can get married. You can't just get up and get married anywhere. But not compulsory. A church. No, so hold on. Okay, hold okay, let's The fact that no, everywhere is allowed, every other place, on, other specific on, places are allowed, doesn't mean that the church the cap, alone is a place where so you can get have the wedding the at cap, any other place. And at okay. places, but the, 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 listen, you see okay, let counselor come in. The cap oh, you know, you don't give me chance to talk. No, I they tell me to cool down for that. I'm hearing that all parks in Ghana are not gazetted. Is it true? Thank you. So, the cap one, yes, the cap one two seven says that the person doing the marriage one must be gazetted okay the premises must mm. be gazetted and when i tell you the things you go through to gazette your premises for marriage ama comes fire come internal revenue will come before a registered journal will come so there are so many things you do for the place to be gazetted okay now when you are transferring the gazetted document from the place to a park it's not so most people who go to the park they sign and go with already signed certificate to the yeah. park yeah. This is a trick. Mm -hmm. So while the thing is happening at the forecourt of a particular park or whatever a place that is not gazetted, they have already signed a document. I see. I queried the marriage that was not concerning me that was done at 6 p.m. Mm -hmm. in, in, in one place in Ghana. I followed it. Mm -hmm. And I and when I followed it before the truth came up that they only came to deceive the people sitting there, including the pastor who came to talk. They have already gone to do that thing because they know it was illegal. To do it so, at the venue. Yes, because okay. so we are doing a garden where now all of you want to have a garden wedding. You can have a garden reception. But not a garden but wedding. But per the ordinance cap 127, these are the things that you need. You cannot, you, you can't, even a traditional marriage. Are you aware that the only place that marriage can be contracted under the customary marriage, it is you, your father's side. Mm -hmm. So there are laws that they came to meet and they enacted from 84 
to 85, they enacted the laws according to our customary right. So when people say that, hey, I want to have a garden wedding, you can have a garden reception. But not a garden But not wedding. a garden wedding. Now, the church, if the church is gazetted, I, my place, the church is the only one gazetted within the area. So all other churches around use our register. Oh. So watch it here. Okay. So there's a church in a school, in a classroom. They can't marry in a place. So because I have a register, when you say you have, you mean the church? The has. church okay. has a register. I'm gazetted. They have not been given the permission within a particular... Is it 120 or something, something meters? I'm forgetting. That you can go to that radius to go and perform okay. the marriage and it should be signed there. Okay. After you sign, you are reception. Mind you, reception is not part of the laws that governs the ordinance marriage. So you can get married without a reception you, to save costs? No, it's not saving costs. The cloud, the word is cloud of witnesses. The law permits that the cloud of witnesses should have things that show that they witness it. That's just to sign. No, not, not those. Who, I mean, they, they, I came to your wedding. Uh -huh. So I have come to spend time with you. Yeah. Breaking bread together is part of what shows that I came. So, so I must say, feed you. It's, it's, it's not feeding. I came. So what do you give to me? Yeah. But you're and saying reception, breaking bread and all reception that. is not you who started and you're going to stop it. Mm -hmm. If you are poor. All right, and poor people are those who have weddings without reception. No, I'm not telling necessarily. You. I am telling I'm, you. If I'm a modest person and no, I really don't feel modest. like you spending, no, there, there is a standard which is an SOP for marriage. So you can't tell me I'm modest. So I'm using two metals twisted together as a ring because I'm modest. Can you do that? No. Okay. You understand? So there's nothing called modesty in the thing when you have spent. So I'm saying that in the first place, monkeys play by sizes. Mm -hmm. I am begging poor people. All right. To make sure they marry within their level. Rich people should not marry the poor. They will destroy the families. What kind of wedding did you have? If you see it in my time of getting married, you think that I'm breaking protocol. Oh. I'll bring you my video to play on TV3. <laughs> is it not on YouTube? And you check the... You know, it, I want us to find it on no, YouTube. My, my wedding is not on YouTube. You have just reminded me. If I put Why? It, because it wasn't no, a big wedding, so no. you were shy to post it. Unfortunately, all the people who came, the celebrities that came... Celebrities they, were at your wedding? Oh, yes. I'm a celebrated person. <laughs> if you can hear them laughing at you somewhere, you understand people are laughing. Oh, you, you, you can't hear them oh, laughing but, in the studio. But if you should marry, if you have key personalities, I don't want to mention the name. You think you it's don't a need key personalities at your oh, wedding? Oh no, no matter the member, they're I friends said, of it's yours. Not about Bella, a big wedding or a small Bella, wedding. If you are not the most important, is a proper wedding. What is a proper wedding to you? Yeah, a proper wedding is about who attended, who wanted to attend. But how do you want Kelly. to take care of them? <laughs> Bella, if you, what are you what saying? Are you saying? If you, you play your cards where you're getting married, uh -huh. there are some people that we least expect them to officiate weddings. They will come. One of the pe pe persons that came to officiate the wedding at a place I was shocked was one of the big bishops in the country. Mm -hmm. He came to a particular wedding ceremony, and I was like, what? Then the relationship and the connection. And when some people are coming to an event, there is an arrangement and protocol that must be followed. Mm -hmm. So if that Gote makes a mistake, to come to my second marriage, the environment will change. You have to up your game for yeah. Dangote. Because what I did, there was no Dangote in the list. You mm -hmm. know me? Actually, I've told you that me, I don't befriend poor people. I, I only see. help the poor. I see. No, my friends are not poor people. I help poor people. Ah. But I like to befriend the rich so that, you know, the rich people, when you befriend them, when you have a trouble or your, your family, you lost your mother, all of a sudden you call them, Ow, oh, mommy, they yeah. will start, Hey, better not go. Oh, is it this time we die? Oh, but the rich person, I just told my mother, Oh, sorry, uh, which mortuary is he now? I call it. No, 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 no. Hold on, uh, hold on for me five minutes. They are calling a funeral home and they are ordering an ambulance okay. uh, ahead to All come right. for the body. So befriend the rich and such people when having weddings and you give them okay. an invitation card, they don't ask you that when, whatever. They okay. look at the invitation card and say, uh, Can I provide you? 40 cartons of wine, 20 cartons of water. These are the people, <laughs> Bella, you are not married. Befriend people like this. Don't befriend people that, hey, if you do a big wedding, they take your home, you don't have children again. Hey, hey, Bella. If don't you marry a rich man, this if you marry a rich Bella man, or... because she's only single person here. This, if you marry a rich man, the love will Bella. come. Listen to me. Bella, don't marry okay. love. Marry money. Let us attend. Hey, let, let us attend your wedding. And the symbols of marriage. Don't marry anyway. that. Marry money. Okay. 
That is Let what me I'm read a few messages. Fools money this one says, money, the, money. the young man in your studio doesn't know what he's talking about. He's reciting the fairy tale. Nanayao. Wow. I guess he's referring to Kelly Daniels. Uh, I'm, 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 good. It's, it's, I'm happy to be a young man. Should it's we not be... Wait, wait. About. Should we... Should, wait. Should we not be more concerned about life after marriage? Shouldn't that be My where points. you should focus so on? So when I talk like Bella. that, they say I don't so know what that, talking about. What's the point? Listen People have me. had lavish Bella. weddings Bella. and Listen they divorced after you. two weeks, Bella, the reason why two they're months. Divorcing, you know that this girl, uh, I am where this woman is married now. The witch. Chewa uh, Beye. Chewa, the one who had one, one, one 45, 45 minutes wedding. You mean the actress Chewa? You know the actress Chewa. Yeah, I, I Chewa. just saw that she got married. She's been married again to another man in Abroji. Yeah. So why do you fear divorce? If you do a lavish wedding today, Bella, and you collapse, we're happy with it. It's a record. So you shouldn't worry about divorce. Mm -hmm. I see. Uh, Good talk. morning, please. I want to ask Councillor Luchos, which one is he choosing now, big or small? Well, he says big. Uh, Bella, are we talking about wedding reception or just the wedding? They are not the same. If I have forty to fifty thousand to spend on a reception, I'd rather spend ten to fifteen thousand, which is possible by proper planning. Charlie, I don't think so. Well, this is poverty mentality. <laughs> Oh, and buy money. an average car for my wife. No need to impress to achieve early gains. Many, many billionaires even do have small garden weddings, and they are cool. John, Crystal Rose. Friends. They don't have small garden, garden wed weddings. Yeah, uh, let me explain to you. Sometimes well, it might be small, but the cost involved is still huge. I think that your wedding should not be big. Neither should it be small because it involves two families. However, the couple should spend within their means and do something which is economical. Please, let your guests stop interrupting each other because we can't hear when they do that. I've so, tried. Sorry stop. <laughs> the woman should make a complaint to the police for the man to give 10 sensible reasons why he has money but want to do that small wedding. If he can't, then they should do it now or else he should be sentenced. Thickness from Fosukrom. Okay. Wedding uh, was a foreign culture, and we have adopted it. The wedding should be done according to earnings. Don't go in for a wedding that will leave you in a state of debt in your whole lifetime. To me personally, I don't see anything wrong with doing a big wedding once the resources are available. But if the resources are not uh, there, then I don't see the need. But I think small weddings is enough because I want to buy a baby walker for my kids. Oh, but you can still buy a baby walker see, regardless. So poverty mentality. That people want to see after wedding what we will eat. But I'm saying that Bella. Bella. I've seen there, my my time is up. My producer no, says I should wrap up. Final words. You know something? We go. Well, we well unfortunately, have, I don't even have time to allow them to speak. And I, so I, I would have I, go go on. Please mention Kelly your Daniels pages office, so we can go on Instagram. We would have a live um, um, session after now. Kelly Daniel's office. Go there. Let me let you know what a proper wedding is. Okay. A proper wedding. I'm going to explain to you so that you don't know. I mean, the difference between a big wedding and a small. What we need to know is what is proper to be done. Kelly Daniel's office on Instagram. Follow me now. Um, my WhatsApp number is 055-313-5074. That's 055-313-5074. But basically, go to Instagram now on Kelly Daniel's office. Let's discuss this immediately after the show. And let's have a, a, an idea of what a proper wedding should be. Because big or small, God's not going to ask you that. What's important is did you do the right thing? Pleasing to God and your conscience. Certainly, your conscience okay. has to be connected to Counselor. God. So please go. Kelly Daniel's on Instagram. All right, counselor, you. can you please Well, the most, the most important thing in life is that God is not interested in your marriage, actually. He's interested in your Christian life. So anybody who lies to you that marry and please God, God doesn't even attend your marriage at all. He comes to the reception. So God blesses. You're, you're, no, he doesn't. It's family that blesses. No pastor has power to bless any marriage. The first thing is that the legal rights ah. you should follow. And what so are you talking God has not come on any any platform. To Kelly, we're done. Anymore. He's just given his so if his you want social media. Media. if you want to have a Kelly, big Kelly, reception, Kelly, thing, Kelly, please. Most of you Ca are thinking that when you become a good Christian, you get a good wife. It's a lie. Counselor, I can mean, you God drop your is, yes, I'm dropping it for them. Those of you want to have a big reception. It's not big wedding. It's a big reception. Write this number down. 0277. Uh -huh. Don't don't rush. Write it slowly because I know you want to prove that you are rich. 0277 <laughs> The same way information goes to all of you. The, the Council of Utrecht Fan Club is on the way. 6th of March, we are launching it. Just send your name, the job you do, and the place you live to 0277 For My sister, if you are old enough to marry, Get okay. more money. Like my Bella. time is up. The wedding for Bella. Miss G. If I say Bella, you're gonna. <laughs> Miss G is coming up with no. entertainment news. Stop giving me.